guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm doing a comparison video so if you're someone who likes slgs especially key pouches or key cases you'll want to watch this video because i am doing a comparison between two key pouches that i have um that i really like but i do tend to use one more than the other so if you're interested go ahead and keep on watching but before we go ahead and get started, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. And if you haven't, press that notification bell so you can get notified every time I upload a video. And go ahead and give this video a like if this is the type of video that you'd like to see. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. So I am comparing the, well, I shouldn't call this the key pouch, but the Penny, the Coach Penny Car Case. But the reason I am putting it in the category of a key pouch is because it does have the key um, chain on the inside so you can attach your keys to it. And that is pretty much how I have been using this one. And I'm comparing it to the Gucci key pouch, okay? Which is also one that I, I like to use this one as well, okay? So let's go ahead and start with the coach one since I have my stuff in it already. So this is the Coach Penny card case. It is in the signature brown print with a black trimming. So it has a black magnetic pocket where you can slide in cards or cash. That nice magnetic closure. You can um, put more cards or cash in here. I just tend to leave the care information in here um not for any not not because i'm trying to sell it i just keep it so that i know what it is um but you can also add like more cash or more cards in there if you like um and then you have the large interior so let me remove the key part and all of my keys so you can just see the inside so then you have this interior with black lining fabric lining you have a, a little coach tag here if you can see that um, so it's a good size you can pretty much put a lot of stuff in here I do have quite a bit of keys because I carry my husband's spare car keys I carry um, we have quite a few keys to the house um, like we have a gate key and um, you know, a back door key and stuff like that. So there's quite a bit of keys that I have to the house. So, and then I also have our alarm key fob. I have my other main house key. I do have my Paris keychain, And then I would have my car key, which is not attached to this at the moment, but I think it's downstairs and I don't feel like going to get it. <laughs> but anyway, so let me put all of the keys in it. And then I can show you. So I put my keys in there. So the, the keys that I don't need to pull for that often, I don't bother attaching them to the to the chain. So I just stick them at the bottom because if I need them, I can just pull them out. So that is all of those at the bottom. And I still have quite a bit of space. So I do need this because this is the alarm key fob for the house. So I'll stick that in there. It is attached to the chain. But I also have my where's my other keychain, which is the main one that I use. And this one I have attached it to a I don't know, like a little clip that I can just attach and unattach. So if I just need to take this and not nothing else, then I can just easily unhook it. But I'm gonna hook this back on because this is kind of how I use it. And these are all attached. So I stick this in there. Um, I do have the flashlight because I just like to have the flashlight on my keys. So in case ever I need to have some light when I'm out or, you know, I'm trying to get my key out and find the, the lock to the door, it's easy. I can hit the flashlight. And so I do not try to shove this in here. I'm sure it could probably go, but I don't think it will close. So I just leave this out as like a nice little decorative keychain zip it up and then I have all of my keys in one spot it's still shaking this side it is still slim not bulky 
I have space to put cards or cash. And so like when I'm going to like the gas station and I need to run inside, I just grab this. I will throw in my ID and my card and just head on into the gas station. And I don't need anything. If I need to do a quick run to the store, I may just grab this and leave. Um, and like I said, add my uh, ID and my card and just leave. Um, you can also add extra items. So let's see, say you wanna throw your lip balm, maybe a lip gloss, you can do that. Can't promise because this this is a Fenty gloss and her gloss is a thick honey. The little packaging is thick, but there you go, still in there. Let me put some cards in here so you guys can see. You can just stick. And let me see because sometimes I can't remember which pocket I prefer. I think I like to, yeah, I like to use when I'm using this with my keys. I usually stick like my cash if I have cash in this. And then I stick um, my cards in this one. It's just a little bit more easier to get them in and out. Let me take the care card out of there. And move it. Okay, so in there I have two cards to represent my ID and my card, and then I have all my keys, and I even have a lip gloss and a lip balm. Okay, now this lip balm is a little fat, so we'll take that one out, but say you wanna, I'll leave the lip balm in there, and say you wanna bring in your mask, cause you know, where you're going, you still need to use your mask. You can take your mask, put it in there, zip it up and then you're good to go. I will, let me try to look up the dimensions of this to see if that helps you. I don't know that stuff, so let me get prepared. Okay, so the dimensions of this are four and three fourths, three quarters in length, this way, and then three and three quarters in height, and then three quarters in width. Okay, so this one is pretty much the size of just like a small wallet. Um, so there that is. But I have pretty much everything I need to make a quick run. And it's just easy to grab, fits in your hand, easy. You can throw it in your pocket, like a coat pocket, or say you're wearing a sweatshirt with a um, big pocket on the front, you can throw it in there and be good to go. So that's this one. Now let's move on to the Gucci key pouch. This is the Gucci Marmont key pouch. I know they also have the one in the Ophidia print. I decided to go for the one in the leather because I just didn't want the Ophidia print one. Plus it, it looks smaller and I wanted the, the leather one. It could just be in my own imagination that it was smaller or that it looked smaller, but it looks smaller. I feel like this one was a little bit bigger. So I wanted the one that was bigger because I knew I had a lot of keys. So this one is in the color, I think it came in black, um, red, and the nude. And this one is nude, but on the website they were calling it pink, but it is definitely nude. Um, and then the interior is brown fabric lining. It has the Gucci tag in the back, and then you get the nice Gucci uh, keychain. Okay, so let me go ahead and hook my keys to this and show you how I use it. This one there. Okay, so I also keys in the bottom that I don't need regularly. Because you do have to kind of like get them to lay in a certain kind of way. So there, that other keys. Go in there and so I have those and they're at the bottom I'll put my alarm key fob on so to open this clasp you just pull it out and 
twist it. So I put that on. And then I don't even really need to hook my other one so I can close this. And because this one, my main keys have the uh, lobster class on it, I just hook it on and there I go. So this is how I have it attached. And I throw the whole thing in. Once again, I leave out the um, flashlight just because it's bulky. Okay. And that's all the keys in there. And the flashlight will be out. And then I zip it up. I still have space to put other things in here. So same thing, if you are just getting out the car, the gas station, need to run in real quick, you can also throw in your um, card, your ID, and go about your business. Um, if you're just using this to run a grocery run or you know do a quick run to the store for something at Target, you can use this as your bag and throw in those extra items. So let's put the cards in first. Set this up here so you guys can see it. Take the two cards out. So I will put in two cards and I will stick them in the back. and in there with all of my keys and it still zips up no problem okay if you want to add like i said you're making your errands and you don't want to carry your bag here you go throw on your lip balm you need a mask we're adding a mask oh, let me fold it up a little tighter mask and that's all in there. You have your car keys, you have your house keys, you have your alarm, you have your ID and credit card, and there you go. And this one does fit nicely in the hand. You can just grab it, carry it like this. You can also throw it in your coat pocket, throw it in your sweatshirt pocket. You cannot fit this in your jean pocket or any type of pants pocket because it's too thick. Now, so both of them serve their purpose. I love them both. When I got this one, I moved straight into it. And I used it nonstop for months. Um, I do love it. However, once I got this one, <clears throat> I did the same thing, but I have not really gone back to this one because this one I feel like is a lot slimmer. However, it is bigger in height. Let me get the dimensions of the Gucci one so that you all can see. Okay, so I couldn't find the dimensions of this exact version, the Marmont version, but this is the dimensions of the Ophidia one. Um, this it is five and a half in the, in the width, three inches in height, and then one inch in depth. Okay, so this one is definitely longer than this one and definitely chunker, chunkier. However, it, it this one is like three quarters and this one is one inch, such which it doesn't look like. This one looks like it may be double that, but um, the only reason that I didn't pull for this one as much once I got this one is because this one is slimmer. So when I'm putting it in my bag, it was it would fit easier. Whereas this one, because you have that chunkier width at the bottom, you sometimes had to place and play Tetris to get it in your bag. And I don't always like to play Tetris in my bags. So love this. And I love this, but I definitely use this one more. So if you have not gotten your hands on the Coach Penny Card Case, 
try and get it. It's definitely worth it. I mean, and you don't have to use it as a key pouch. You can use it as a wallet. You can use it as your little essentials pouch. You can use it as your feminine pouch. You can use it as whatever. Um, but it does definitely work really well as a key pouch and an all around grab and go type item. I hope you all enjoyed this comparison video. I hope it was thorough enough for you and I showed you uh, how you can use it and what can actually fit. So if you like this type of content, please give this video a thumbs up so I can know that you want to see more videos like this. And as always, thank you guys for watching and I hope you all stay safe, stay blessed, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.